Uh, hello, so the third episode, so the first two videos were about uh, the first lesson, it means that the first session, uh, one hour of activities. Here is the second hour of uh, the project. So the first step is to give a um, quick uh, vocabulary test of five minutes maximum. And the idea is that I ask uh, eight words or expressions to my students and they have a, a paper and they have to to check it so they begin with 20 out of 20 and they have uh, one point less for each mistake and then they they have this paper for the next uh, vocabulary test so that after three three sessions they will have a mark out of 20 and the objective is to keep the maximum each time it's more motivating I think after uh, the students have to exchange their ideas about the text, the text they have to read about the yuppies and then we have um, a common moment to complete the timeline and the conceptualization of the inference uh, clues so it's a moment of conceptualization of grammatical items and uh, namely here the comparative the uh, adverbs of degree the irregular verbs in the past the passive voice and the compound nouns which are points of grammar uh, which can be done in this way because i think that grammatical things are better in terms of specificities concerning a document or a situation or a need to produce uh, English. After, they have to be by four and I give them a, a team file in which they can put all the papers they have to give me if they have homework. So I give them again the tablet of 3O and uh, I give them individually a logbook which is um, a document uh, with uh, the name in which you can find all the elements to follow up the work. So in the left part, the levels in the different skills with the, the check of the level reach, their objectives, which can be also goals, personal goals, and not only about English, to, to suggest the fact that uh, lessons are also a question of self-development. The different productions here, and I will uh, explain to you in another video, the resources they are going to use, uh, videos or text to read, and also part about peer tutoring and autonomy things I will uh, develop um, after. So they, they, they have this element and they have to take the copy books and they have to choose the element they need to answer the, the question, which is um, is there a huge break between the generational labels or not? So they have to pick out the specific elements individually. And after they have the time uh, to, to think about the common points. So they, I, I give them seven minutes about elements in their copy books. Because the idea that is after they have completed the A3 paper, they can't use their copy books anymore so they have to really uh, select the information they have learned and um, they find they are the most useful and efficient and it's important i think to me to make them work about the fact that they have to select information to use for an objective so after they again uh, discuss together about the uh, common elements and they have to suggest um, uh, an outline for a production uh, in a written or in oral form and because they have to consider that I have them um, particularly and when they have to show and explain to the other teams the the outline they have chosen they have to use structure like we're going to first will then will finally will and because to give them the idea that using grammar for a communicative objective here, a question about the, the near future or to explain things with because or further and finally to begin to suggest them that it's important to structure their ideas. 
And by using prompts, I think we can develop oral in a more um, effective way. And then uh, they have to know how work for the moment. But the idea is that they have to, to know that they have to learn their lessons, um, I would say, regularly. So in the next lesson, okay, so which is uh, the third lesson in the rotation one, first, once again, a vocabulary and expression test. And then I will see that they have to obey the idea that to learn their lesson regularly. And after, uh, I will do what I will explain in another video, which is the rotation thing.